Hi everyone, in this video we're going to outline and explain how you can create a macro in Excel which deletes defined rows. So this is a request that has come through to the channel, so I thought I'd pop a quick video up on the channel to explain how this is done. So there's a couple of reasons why you'd want to do this, there's quite a lot of reasons actually. As part of different macros you might be inserting new rows to calculate formulas out which then need to be deleted afterwards. There's quite a few applications for this. So I'm going to explain how this is done. First of all, if you are new with Excel macros, please follow the playlist up at the top right now. Basically, you need to do a few things before you can get started with this. So those two videos will get you up to speed. Follow those and come back. If you already know what you're doing, let's dive into this. So the example that we've got today, we have a button which essentially deletes row four. So as you can see, we've got rows one to 10 here. If I press the button, it deletes anything that's in that top row, the entirety of the row. Okay, so how do we do this? I'll open our button up. It's very simple. We only have two lines of code. And I'll just explain how these work. The first line of code essentially is where you're picking your sheet. So the sheet that you're working from and then the range. Remember we said that we're deleting row four. You can essentially select any range or any cell within the row you want to delete. Once that's selected from the active cell, we then pick the entire row and delete it. So all you need to do is paste these two lines of code between private and end sub, adjust your sheet name if needed and your range to the row you want to delete. And that's essentially done. Okay, I hope that's been helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please pop them in the link below. If this has helped you, please like and subscribe. And thanks for watching. See you next time.